Let's watch this then. The most disturbing websites. From royalty is here. I like his stuff. I so like his stuff. So if I asked what is the worst website imaginable, probably with that smooth brain of yours, you may say something like 4chan, the deep crevices of Reddit. What do you guys think, Chad? What do you all think? What's the worst um, website that there could be? I would probably think 4chan too. <laughs> Twitch? Twitter? Okay, Twitter? Yeah, sure. But... Anything on the dark web? That's a good answer. That's a good answer. M. Dismaley, thanks for the follow. Twitter than Fortune and Reddit. You think Twitter's worse than Fortune? Was rotten for me? I don't know that I'm neutral. Hmm. But you can buy missiles on the dark web. Can we really come? <laughs> Did my mod really just post my own link there? Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. What's that one website where they film people actually getting... What? What? Wasn't that something like Life Leaks? Wasn't that Life Leaks or something? That was probably a bad one, man. That was... That was probably a really bad one. Am I the asshole for violating a pigeon? <laughs> Bro... <laughs> what do you mean violating? What do you mean violating? And... Horny. Okay, I don't. I don't want to read this any further. If if you want to read this further, here yeah, let me make myself a little bit smaller. You can pause pause the video and read this on your own. We are moving on from this. We are moving on from this. No, like no Simple exploration on the dark no. web or even your own Facebook page. Yeah, I would hate a website that was constantly showing me a dirty, ugly <laughs> humunculus as well. Begs another question, why are you still using Facebook in 2024? But no, True. for one of the worst websites that is available on the clear web, not the dark web. Yes, I already know, any website on the dark web requires a holy crusade. But no, today we're focusing on the- Have you guys ever been on the dark web? I have- n I don't even know how to access it, and I don't even want to know, man. I don't even want to know. I don't want to go in the unholy place. I don't want to go there. It scares me. Like, just scares me thinking about it. Like, I don't know. When I think of the dark web, I, like, imagine in my head that everything around me is just dark. All the websites have a dark background and everything is, like, written in, like, white text. <laughs> I don't I don't know. Yes, I was, but I didn't really find something disturbing. Okay. Gobo know how to but never been. Alright, dark mode? Yeah, like dark mode like. My ex did when she was in the cybersecurity lab. It was fucked with a lot of Yeah, yeah, I, I can imagine. Oh you said hello, hello. I thought about buying a cheap laptop connecting to McDonald's wife and going to toy. Bro. Tell you what I thought too. <laughs> yeah, like that's what I'm thinking, man. That's what I'm thinking. That it's literally just like, everything is dark mode. Like, I don't know. Like, is it like Google, but like dark? Is the dark w web like a website where you have like different links to all the shady things you can do? I don't, I don't actually know. I actually have no idea about the dark web, man. Clear web for the website you can interact with even today, just by simply typing in the URL and translating to probably English. But before I tell you the name, are you familiar with Death Note? No, I'm not the mm, mentally yeah? ill person in your class. I, I am familiar with Death Note, but never watched Ass. it. That has grew an attraction to you and is now offering you some smooth stones, seemingly out of nowhere. This topic does in fact I relate to the website, something. but Death Note was an anime and manga with a live action which we will not talk about. It belongs in yeah. the very many crevices of hell. But Death Note, if you don't know what it is, is quite simple. It revolves around an item called the Death Note. Which you is write an I uh, a name in it, and it, it offs that. them. Right. It offs the person in it. Name in that Death Note will and despawns them. Kill them. And in despawn. addition to that, you can add how they die and when they die. Wait, but if you Wait you could even add that in? That I didn't know. This information, they'll just die from a heart attack. Death Note was very popular around the 2010s, especially in Japan and when anime grew in more Western countries. Believe me, if Damn. you managed to piss off an emo or goth kid of that time to the point where they harbored serious aminosity towards you, you can probably quickly find your name written on the first page at least 20 times over, and they'll be crossing their fingers and crinkling their toes. 
Not this scene, man. Not this scene. Here to be 20 times over, and they'll be crossing their fingers and crinkling their toes <laughs> every night hoping you don't arrive at school tomorrow. But what I'm trying to say is that concept of Death Note was very popular For free? Yes. and wildly accepted, to the point where some yeah. people resorted to superstition out of hatred for others and would write people's yeah. names in notebooks People would actually do that. People are crazy. Hoping that something very unfortunate would happen to that person. People... But what... Bro, the people that did that are actually just so fucking cringe, man. Holy cringe. Holy mother of cringe shit. What happens when you start doing that and have a hatred for someone you're meant to love? And somebody you willfully chose to potentially spend the rest of your life with? And Wait, I'm what? talking about marriage, your wife or husband. Oh my god. Wait, chat. Is this... Is this going into a... Oh my god, is this going to into a transition where you could literally write a name down for like a hitman list? Oh no. And this hatred for oh their no. significant other and the popularity of Death Note led to oh the creation no. of a website where users gathered together to wish the death of their partner in detailed and gruesome ways and showing their reason yeah, for it, does it look and like their an deep Asian hatred for this person they're meant to love and with some of them apparently coming true and they show their thanks- Thank you, Grim Reaper! ...fullness to this website for apparently killing their partner. And this website is called danshine.com. Oh no. A Japanese website heavily inspired by Death Note, where wives contribute to the website, expressing hatred wives. and distaste Lovely. towards their significant other. Just leave! Like, if you hate them, like, if you're already aware, right? They don't seem to be in an abusive relationship in that case. Like, if they're aware that they hate them. Why don't you leave in that case? With the conclusion of them wanting them to die. And just reading a few... A Japanese website explains everything? Why? Why would that explain everything? What do you mean? Last night was on my computer and everything turned from English to full Chinese, locking me in a Google page. <laughs> How? There's so much fucked up shit. Is there? I, I am unaware. A few of these posts, you can see throughout the text how desperate they are to have their signal. What does this say? My idiot husband died of heart failure while playing a game at home on this date at around 9 p.m. I found him when I got home at around 10 p.m. I was late in finding him and couldn't give him proper treatment, so he was confirmed that God of death, please kill my stupid husband quickly. I'm about to die myself. Huh? Huh? Oh, wait, it's like, oh, no, 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 I get it, I, I, no, 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 shit, I get it, I get it, I get it, it's, no, 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 not bad translation, it's Death Note style, you know, it's Death Note style, so, you know, prediction as to how, why, and what's going to happen, yeah, 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 significant other die, well, I rarely get up early in the morning, right, that's just your own opinion, oh dear, I don't like the way you say it, I don't like the idea of even getting your mother-in-law involved. Well, I rarely get up early in the morning, do you think? That's just your own impression. The shrine cleaning is early this morning. Will you be able to wake up properly? Don't laugh and say that, you worthless parent and child. Get your act together, you scum. Just die. What the hell? My damn husband wants me and my what daughter to live somewhere else so he can spend the rest of his life with that old hag. So there's no point in him living anymore. Whatever I do. Bro, like... As angry as I can be at times, like, I have low-key anger, anger issues, right? And like, we all just have bad things when we play toxic games, especially League of Legends, right? I don't actually wish someone to die. Like, for example, like, for example, like, Trump with the assassination uh, incidents. There were so many people saying, the too bad he missed, better hit him next time, all that shit. That is so crazy. People actually wishing death upon someone else, man. Like, 
I I don't have words for that, man. It's crazy. Rational people do not wish death on others. Yeah. Yep. 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 True. 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 I think of that old hag first. Our family is unhappy because this old hag is alive. This also, I talked about that my stepfather was abusive. I, I wouldn't wish death upon him. I, I would wish that he would just go somewhere else where he's none of my business anymore, right? And well, I did leave the family, so he is none of my business anymore in that sense. I literally ran away from home. So, yeah, I wish that he would just leave, gun, be somewhere else, where you don't mind me, where you do your own shit, you know? Just leave me alone, but still wouldn't wish the worst upon people. Like, bro, life is already too fucking short. Old Hag is a money pit and is of no use, so I hope she dies soon. Oh, my great. old husband wants me and my daughter to live somewhere else so he can spend the rest of his life with her. Yay! So there's no point in him living. Please die soon together with your beloved old hag. Bruh. Just die. Even though I pay more than I- What about PDF files? I- I don't wish death upon anyone, man. Like, that, that's quite the moral dilemma in the end. Like, in the end, that's quite the moral dilemma. Like, I don't wish for someone to die, but if it happened to them, I wouldn't care either. You know? Like, if, it if they did end up dying, I wouldn't care about either. It would, to me, it would be like, okay, good riddance. Goodbye, then. I mean, if... They are not hurting anyone, I guess it's fine. Just cut their bolts? Yeah, true. 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 And every month, I can't resist eating and drinking. I don't take my medicine when I go to the doctor for my illness. Please stop going to the hospital. Like, lock them away. Put them in jail. It's a waste of time. I can't feel satisfied unless I do it when I want to. So I throw a tantrum. The pain of having to keep going until I get it, even though I'm not even hard, it's a relief to be able to vent here, but it won't change my situation of having no money. Please die and get my insurance money. I'm Bro. sure will be happy if- Of course, of course, of course, the insurance money. Of course it's about the insurance money. Okay. Bro, these, these people fucking pussy as shit, man. These people wish death upon someone else, but are too scared to do it themselves, man. At least fucking, fucking commit to it then. If you wish death upon someone else, fucking commit for, for it then and stand for it. Don't be a fucking pussy about that shit, man. Oh my god, this is pissing me off. Papa, thanks for the follow. Like, if you're gonna be about this already, fucking get rid of them then. And fucking accept the consequences that are going to happen to you too then. Oh my god, man. Oh my god. You're gone. You only live for your own pleasure and vanity. Pussy ass shit, stop man. Breathing fucking insane morning. people. Now with it being a Japanese website with the majority of the posts being predominantly in Japanese, and throughout the translation errors and sentences that seemingly make no sense or switch to third person then back to first person. Uh, that's that Japanese. That That is literally Japanese. Where uh, the Japanese have sentences where they do speak about themselves in third person, where it would be translated to be into first person. So that's just a translation issue. You'll get the message that exuberates from these posts. They wholeheartedly want their partner to die so they can be set free. And these are some of the more tame posts. Some crazy. of the more heavy ones will... <laughs> that is crazy that this is one of the more tame ones. What the later. hell? But you may be looking at some of these posts and just wondering, why don't they just leave? Why are they wishing death upon someone they can just leave? And probably never see them again. That's what I'm thinking, like, if it's the case of them being in an abusive relationship, then yes, again, it's not that easy, but they've already, like, they're already writing heinous shit about that they hate the, the other person, you know? They're already in a step towards where they know that the other person, at least to them, is an awful person. Borne, uh, name, Borne, Bonama? Borna Mad Goddess? 
Thanks for the follow. Sorry, I I struggled for the a bit there. The rest of their lives. Well, the reason they don't leave or divorce their partner is because it's Japan. I know some of you weebs out there okay. that watch a that's... lot of anime. Okay, that's have that fair. Bright sparkle in your eye every time Japan is mentioned, and Japan just being in a sentence is an activation word <laughs> that releases an un. <laughs> the weebs. The weebs. But Japan has so many social rules, it's probably why. Right. Yeah, yeah, probably, yeah. As you said, the worst thing, things that have been said is located in a place called League of Legends said, true. True, 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 true. Isn't there something like this with Hatsune Miku? Wait, what do you mean? And what, what do you mean? Precedent amount of euphoria, like these weebs were getting a prostate massage. And many of them look at Japan with rose-tinted glasses. That's because true. Because of the presence of things like anime Many do look has like it, skewed like that. their opinion. Add it like Showing that. Japan as this great place like it is in the animes. And they probably have plans to move there eventually. And yes, whilst Japan is a great place and very culturally rich, it is one of the leaders in suicides each year, with on average 20,000 people ending themselves each Yep, and a decline of... You mean Japan is not like the animes? Yeah, I'm sorry to burst your bubble. <laughs> Sorry to burst your bubble. Yeah, the birth rate is declining. Yes, exactly. The birth rate is declining. Yeah, due to things like the work-life balance in Japan being so abhorrent, where things like time off and not doing overtime is looked down upon, and people can quite easily find themselves working six days a week, often ten hours a shift. Jesus Christ, man! This is this is insane. This is insane. Either way. I will try to like uh, pause the videos now when we have ads playing. That was a shift with social pressure installed at bear to study hard, work hard and keep working. Also on top of the fact for a long time Japan stick to its old ways like with divorce where until modern times there was a stigma around divorce where it was looked down upon. And even though Japan's divorce rate is rising, some people yep. still stick to that stigma or don't go through a yep. divorce due to the fact it gets harder if both parties do not consent to the divorce. Or Lovely. Or if there are children involved. Because only Yo, until back, recently, okay, shared custody wasn't a thing. Scared custody is not a thing? Wow. Uh, let's get, uh, let's have a handful of seconds back. Why can't I throw something at her face? Because we're in the middle of a reaction video. While we are in the middle of a, a reaction video, we do not throw things at me. <laughs> Sponsor block always saves me from ads on YouTube. There you go. The double standard. If I'm late, I will get publicly shamed in the stream. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Either way, back to the video now, okay? Back to the video! Only until recently, shared custody wasn't a thing. That's Only insane one to me. parent could take How? primary custody. Damn. Japan is still pretty old school. And due to that reason, that's why you see on this webpage most women saying they want to pursue divorce after the child has grown up. And the other uh... things I mentioned about Japan, no, I wasn't just using that to deter you from Japan, you little weebs. But please do wash the dirty gym sock. That is your foreskin. Because it's overflowing with smegma. But Bruh! due to the fact it's socially required to work long hours, these women may be reaching their breaking point because of those long hours, or the fact their counterpart isn't pulling their weight. Which you know only... what? That does make sense. Like, actually, that does make sense. Because being created over trivial matters and just general disgust for their counterpart. I, I guess, like, with that context, it does make sense. That it's not as simple as just doing it. That they have just grown really, really tired of their spouse. Just generally using the website to vent. Also, I'm not excusing it. I'm saying that it does make sense in a twist the kind of manner. Many speaking about how they want them to stop taking care of their elderly relatives, which is a popular tradition in Japan. And they want this to stop because they're sinking a lot of time and money into them. Or the elderly relative just doesn't like them and there may be forms of abuse there. But then you oh, have... Of course. Uh, 
I feel bad for the Japanese the posts in this on the sense, website, man. I do feel bad about them. Cries for help as they are essentially getting emotionally or physically abused in the relationship. Oh. Aww. So there are some cases of that on the website too. Man. You smoke, buy alcohol with my money and abuse convenience stores. But I'm worried about what I can eat. Why does he only give me 50,000 yen a month? What what's that on euros? Fifty a thousand yen an euro. Three hundred. Mm. It really depends. It really depends then. Not a lot. Yeah, it really depends for like what? For food? How much do things cost? I don't know. If it's like including builds, including everything. Mm, it's 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 very little. It it is little. It is little. Even though I earn a decent amount, I pay for everything from food and communication there it is. to okay. transport, okay. medical expenses, okay. daily okay. necessities, insurance, taxes, and the cost of the kids. What? Mm. Do you really think it's enough? He's just surviving using a lot of my savings from when I was single. I'm always Yikes. worried about money. I'll provide for you. I'll make you happy. I told you. You smoke, make me buy alcohol with my living expenses and abuse convenience stores. Bruh. Like, I have no issues for either of the partners in a relationship. Like, let's look at the traditional relationship, like uh, a man and a woman. I have no issues with either partner. Like, even... Okay, like, even in the same gender relationships like even then like i actually have absolutely no fucking issues with one partner earning the money and saying i will provide for you i will provide for you i have no fucking issue with that the one saying that you don't have the means right now i will help you out it's okay i have zero problem with that the issue where i take is when the other person fucking abuses that, like in this case, where they are just fucking lazy piece of shit, wasting the money, where they feel entitled to it, and where they say, you only get this much of your own money. That, that is disgusting. I'm still worried about how much I can eat. Die now, god of death, please help me. My son is having tics due to stress, and it seems like he's deliberately imitating them. My son hates shit so much, Son is having tics due to stress, and it seems like he's deliberately imitating them? What? Just that if I take my eyes off him for a second, we start fighting. My son has tics due to stress, and it seems like he's deliberately imitating them now. I feel bad for my son, but I can't divorce now. I tried to go out with my son on weekends so that we don't end up alone, but it started again, today when I was walking the dog. My son left the house and was crying outside. It seems like the person across the street called out to him, asking if he was okay. I feel okay. so pathetic. I want to get out of this situation, but I can't go back to my parents' house. This is a little bit confusing. Her husband is making fun of the child? Oh, is... Oh! Oh! Oh, okay! Oh, that's so bad! Oh my god! Again, my stepfather used to do shit like that. My... My... My younger sister had an issue where... She literally... Like, her brain literally didn't get oxygen for like... A minute or something, so... She is a little bit behind in development. And she has takes where she literally just moves weirdly around, where she like whips back and forth and like does whatever. It's just random as takes. And my stepfather, the piece of shit he is, did imitate them to uh, like fucking looking down upon her, making fun of her in the sense like disgusting, disgusting. And I have nowhere to turn to. Divorce isn't easy. I want to be stronger. Whoops. Even on this holiday, he is bedridden, drinking, smoking, and eating salty food, but he still hasn't come to be with us. Please, God of Death, please, see him in the afterlife before the end of the year. Violence, break. Like, 
again, personally, I never wished death upon my stepfather. I wish that he would just go somewhere else, right? I, I wouldn't wish death upon someone else at all. But I do understand where they're coming from. I do understand where they're coming from. Breaking things, smashing up walls, breaking wedding photos, financial violence, emotional Lovely. violence. Scum, yeah, yeah. self bankruptcy, guy who lends money, guy who doesn't pay back, violence, destroys things, smashes up walls, breaks wedding photos, financial violence, emotional violence, severe mental illness, depression, drug addiction, no hope of recovery, grab hold of you, hey yo. Now, as said, a lot of this is crazy, insane, insane. If someone did that to me, I would really hurt them. If you had the means of them, I wouldn't say I would do it myself. I wouldn't agree with you doing it, but I'd understand it. Venting, and they generally just show distaste towards their counterpart and beg the god of death to take them away. But something more interesting about the website is the categories. There are a number of categories on categories. the dancing website. A lot of them malicious in title. You have my husband dies. I want to kill my husband. And oh boy. Death Note has been reported to be effective. The latter okay. I want to focus on more. Because it seems the people posting to that part of the website genuinely believe this website has done something for them. And the Death Note is real. And just reading some of these posts, it's overall just a stabbing. In a sense, this website, as twisted and dark as it is, right? As twisted and dark as it is, it is a sort of way to give them a hope, you know? Like, it is very dark and twisted, and I'm not saying that it's right. But I'm saying, in a sense, it is like a shimmer of hope to them. Colon cancer after living a life of eating and drinking what I like. My husband- And like, um, what I was going with it is that it's like something they can hold on to. Yes, that it helps them vent, that they can still hold on to in a sense, keep going rather than, you know, it's Japan. They have high, they have high suicide rates. His health check revealed that he may have colon cancer. Moreover, it appears to be malignant. This is the punishment for living his life the way he wanted until now. Colon cancer. After only eating and drinking what he wanted, he also suffers from gout and diabetes. Okay. A parade of so basically saying that he's gotten what he deserved for, like... To her, I guess it seems like finally deserved like something like that i guess that's the way she's trying to portray it here what he himself has caused there is no room for sympathy i was holding back the laughter as i listened to this lol treatment costs money so i wish he would just die but he puts <laughs> himself first so he's probably trying desperately to live well Stop yeah struggling of course. and just go she talks sadly to the people around her but it is just an she act. She talks sadly. Okay, this is about a female person this time. It has some effect. My shitty husband's beloved dog died. He has been oh. yelling a bit. What the dog? Oh, come on. No. He was at me up until now, so he got his revenge. He cried a lot, but by the evening he was fine. He talks about how sad he is to people around him. But is he just acting? This is not enough. I wish he would just die soon. Shitty husband. Bro, she talks sadly to people around her, but is it just an act? I think that's just a missed in translation that he, like, the husband talks sadly uh, to people about uh, the dog. It's a form of a journal, like therapists have a lot of people do. It's just become online and public instead of private. Yeah, 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 that, that, that does sound like a... Uh, that definitely sounds like it, I yeah. I hope it's your shitty husband who dies next. Now the last one- Wait, what? Okay, the, this last one I think is just lost in translation a tiny is bit. Is a bit ambiguous. It describes something happening to her husband, but she doesn't go into the specifics. Lesbians? Like, at one point it talks about husband and then about 
she. I think it's just missed in translation. Instead, she thanks the website and asks for more support. It was quite mm. a shock for my husband. Something very shocking happened to my husband. I've been waiting for you every day. Thank you very much. I'd like to come back to express my gratitude again. So please okay. continue to support me. Now this one begs the question, is she thanking what? the website, the god of death, or the people on the forum? And is she thanking them because something happened to him? Is he dead? Or like the others, has he been stricken with a life-threatening illness? But one mm. thing that is known is that this website is quite chilling. Not only because of the fact it actually exists, but also because people are contributing to it every day, with a new post every hour. So, okay, so a lot are using genuine it. genuine hate for their loved ones. And it begs another question. If these people are genuinely struggling being married to these people, and are desperate to the point where they are making posts, wishing for them to die, at what point when their needs well, are yes, unmet, are they going to take it in? What they're doing, they're basically wishing for it to happen, venting about it, because they can take it anymore. Like, he explained it himself, it's because it's in Japan. Their own hands. But it is just genuinely disturbing this website exists and that there are some stories where the husband has died and they're showing genuine gratitude and giving credit to this website. This website is just something I found and wanted to talk about today. Weebs do not use this website to find a young helpless woman you can save to <laughs> give you a oh my God, okay, green man. card. Because okay, I think man. very early on in the relationship, they'll learn they can't stand you and you'd have your own post on that website. But yeah, bye-bye. <laughs> wow! Wow! Um, what I'm thinking about this is... They... Like, the people that are writing on this website are generally at a place where, because of Japan's culture, that they generally feel like they are trapped in a relationship because... It's Japan's culture! That... Because of Japan's culture, in the end. Uh, to me, this seems like a form of venting in a sort of sense. To me, it seems like the majority are venting, which uh, DJ Mega also said that it's what therapists recommend people do, only that instead of them journaling themselves, it's become pub public. And there's not Dr. Phil to air this out, yeah? The whole thing sounds fucked up and way, way, way too deep. Uh, it is fucked up. Yes, it is fucked up. And personally, again, I do not wish death upon anyone. Anyone. No matter what they did. I do not... I do not think I have the authority or the level of, like, audacity. I don't, I don't fucking know English, right? I, 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 my English sucks, so don't mind that. I don't think... I have the authority to say someone should die, someone deserves to die. I, I do not do that. I don't do that. I do not do that here. And I don't think anyone has that level of authority on people. This, these people think that they are God. No, 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 no. These people don't think they are God. They are begging to a God of death that the God of death would take their husband away. That's what they are doing. That's... They're wishing for something to happen that would free them. Which, in a lot of these cases, I think, in a sense, is understandable. In a lot of these cases, I think it's understandable. I believe karma will make them pay, but karma can take helping hands some days. <laughs> yes, I guess. I guess, I guess. Holy fucks, I'm, I'm far from holy or saintly. I'm far from holy and saintly. There's God, someone would say, God of death. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, 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 definitely. The only situation I, I would have such a wish if someone did something to my mom or my brother. Unholy folks, yeah, more like unholy folks. Yeah, no, I can't understand it. I personally do not agree with it, but I can definitely understand where they're coming from. I can definitely understand where, where they're coming from. But what you can't take God of Death, what is that gonna achieve for you like what the fuck is this some forbidden shit there um this is them it's more like them venting and airing their feelings out them wishing for something 
to free them. They are so desperate and lost and feel trapped in uh, their situation that they are basically praying that something, something above them would free them out of the situation. Coping mechanism almost, I guess? Yes. In a way, it's a coping mechanism. It's like, to them, it's a sort of shimmer of hope. As dark and twisted as it is, as I said, it's a way for them to hold on to life themselves, in my opinion. Either way, that will be that. That will be that. We will finish this topic now here. Thanks for watching, YouTube.